What's up today my fellow Man of Soldiers? So what I'm going to be speaking about in this video is a few things. One thing I'm going to speak about is who I feel you should use your 93 to 94 power up pass on. And another thing is who I'm going to use it on. Because I'm going to use it on this video right now. And then we're going to go ahead and upgrade that individual with the power up pass. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. I'm just going to go ahead and go to the auction block. And just uh, look up some cards for you guys real quick so you can see for yourself. It's better to show you guys and just just speak on it. So we're gonna go ahead and go to the 94s. Because it's 93 to 94, right? So we'll go to 93 too. But the thing is, is that I know a lot of people want to use their 94. I mean, their 93, 94 on a 94 card, especially the NFL 100 cards. Okay, so before I get into it, what I will say right now, if you're running a theme team, I would say you... I wouldn't even say use it. Yeah, you could use it on your theme team. I, I mean, apparently, if you have there's two NFL 100 cards. If not, remember you're gonna get an, a free one when that when when uh in the six week six week of the solos you're gonna get a free or the six week that this comes out you're gonna get a free NFL 100 card. So I would pick the NFL 100 card for the theme team that I'm using. Um, my free one I'll use it on that on the end of, on the power pass. Go ahead and use it for your theme team if you have two players for your theme team like for instance if i have another player on my theme team then i'll probably i would have probably used it on it at this moment i don't and the player that i want to use it on the player i want to use it on is uh is basically someone i'm going to keep for a long time and not just that his cards going for a lot so that's another thing you look at too is use it on a player that his card is going for a lot than the average one like for instance this emma smith is going for 378k if you want another one, like say for instance Ronnie Law or Deion Sanders, why not use it on Deion Sanders? I mean Deion Sanders and just buy Emmitt Smith because or Michael Irvin or Jim Brown because they're cheaper than actually Ronnie Law. Um Ronnie Law. Who else it is? Even he's going for going for low. Barry Sanders, I would still buy him when it comes to that. Even this guy right here, I would use it on. He probably David, 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 Devin. I'm sorry, I'm gonna say David, Devin Hester, Lawrence Taylor, Eric Dickerson, Ed Reed. We got a strong safety, but like I said, the only reason how I encourage you to use the Ed Reed is if you have a theme team and because he's going for a lot. You got Deion Sanders, Ronnie Lott. Um, I guess even the kicker, right? If you guys really want a good kicker, but I wouldn't even waste it on the kicker because they got some pretty decent kickers right now that even if you get them 90, 91 OVRs, then they will do the job for you. But if you happen to, if you have a theme team, then you really want the kicker, you really could afford it. Yeah, I mean, go ahead and power up your card and use your power up pass on that. But what I will say, these are, these are the cards that you could use them on. I would, like I said, I would use my power up pass on someone who's going for a lot more. And then wait for the NFL 100 cards to come out that they're gonna get for, they're gonna give to you for free and use that on your theme team. But if you have two players on a theme team, then go ahead and use your power up pass on that. Use your power up pass on that unless, unless there's another player that you want for your regular team that's cost a lot more. That's what I'm doing. So basically, what I'm doing, I'm gonna use mine on Ronnie Lott. And I'm going to use it on Ronnie Lott because I'm going to keep them for my regular team. And I'm going to keep them for a while. And if there is another card that comes out, like say, just, just say for instance, right? If there's a card that comes out that's going to be worth more than Ronnie Lott, then I'll just take it off Ronnie Lott, put it on my, my theme team player that I want, and then go ahead and buy Ronnie Lott because he's probably going to be a lot. If, I'm saying if he costs more than Ronnie Lott. So that's basically how I'm going to go about using my power up pass so once again i'm gonna reiterate use your power pass on a player that you're gonna keep for a long time and, and usually someone's that's gonna be that's gonna cost a lot more because if he's cheaper you might as well just buy the card and use a power up pass that goes for more otherwise if if there's not another card you care about you just want one of the nfl 100 players or just one of one of a 94 player then just go ahead and use it on that you don't have to worry about it but i'm pretty sure a lot of people especially like myself that they're gonna want more than one of the cards so when we go to the 93s Let's go to the 93s. It's probably going to be way down here. Because you got all these 92s. All these 90s. So you got... Ain't nobody going to want him. No one's going to want him. You, you, They might want... There's no reason to waste your card on that. So the only 93 that I would probably go for... Even if he's cheap. All the 93... I wouldn't even use it on a 93 because they're so cheap. Unless you're going to use it on Troy Palomalo. So let's go here. Strong safety. 
just to make sure real quick and then i'm gonna go ahead and just power up my player and then make it happen so i'll i mean if you're gonna use it on troy then yeah why not i didn't even know he was going for 600k still wow and this is a series redux player so i mean unless you're gonna use it on him because it seems to be he's one of the main ones that's, that's up there when it comes to prices but anyways like I said, I will use it on a player that's going for a lot or use one that's for your theme team if that's all you're going to use it for. Or like I said, you buy the player. If you want two of them, buy the buy the player that's the cheapest and use the one, use the power pass on the one that's most expensive. That's the, that's the way to sum it up. So anyways, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and put my power pass on Ronnie Lot, and then I'm going to put Enforcer and then we're going to see his stats and everything definitely going to put enforcer on him i couldn't wait to use this i know i wanted to use it on deon sanders i'm gonna lie but the, let me tell you why i'm not using it on deon sanders because deon sanders is doing good by itself i need ronnie out ronnie lot out there to go out there and do his thing and especially with that enforcer like them hit sticks i'm telling you right now that pat tillman's doing his thing out there so oh he's an nfl 100 card so we, 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 people are talking about this one okay wait, wait. so he gets reinforcement 100 higher chance to defeat run blocks and disrupt chance. so we're putting that on him off the top because that's where we're going to be activated as soon as the game starts. Then we're going to get an Enforcer. Definitely get an Enforcer. All right. So we see if anything else we want to add on him. Zoned out. Ah, catch us in zone. Nah. We don't need none of that. So we get an improved reactions and catch knockouts in zone. Acrobat diving swats and interceptions. I don't know that. To me, that it don't seem like that's really working. That, uh... The acrobat zone down and pre react catch knockouts in zone and catch knockouts. I'm just gonna go ahead and put acrobat on him. I, to me, I don't really don't see it. It, it really don't look like it, it, it was working on me. Or you could put you could put him as a cornerback and a secondary. I'm, okay, I'm not gonna use it like that. I'm just gonna keep him as yeah. I'm gonna keep him in this position. That's that's fine with me. So we're gonna go ahead and see his uh, see his stats real quick. All right, so he's 93 speed, 95 acceleration, 92 tackle, 92 play recognition, A6 man, 95 zone, 96 hit power. Wow, this card is looking glitchy. He's actually been playing pretty well, so I can't wait to play with this card, especially with the enforcer and everything. So remember, these are the blue cams. Without the blue cams, I'm gonna go ahead and show you real quick without the blue cams, okay? So you guys have a, a thorough understanding of, of that card. So this is without the blue cams. Go ahead and look at your right. Oh, I'm sorry. Here we go. Go ahead and look at your right. Here we go. He's 91 speed, 93 acceleration, 96 hit power, 93 zone coverage, 84 man. Everything, everything is in the 90s besides the man coverage. So that's looking pretty glitchy. So I wanted to show you guys that real quick. But anyways, this is who I'm using my power up pass on. And like I said, the reason why is because Deion Sanders... They're practically going for the same price, but what what I looked at it as, okay, well my Deion Sanders look it, he has 96 speed. Once I get that John Madden collector, he's going to 97. To me, that's pretty pretty good enough to to keep up with the average cornerback. Okay, so the only reason I will get the under Deion Sanders because he'll go up to 99 speed. I'm cool right now. If I had to pick between him and Ron Lott, apparently I picked Ronnie Lott to use it on, right? I could always switch off and put on Deion Sanders if I have to, but I'm going to use it on Ronnie Lott because I feel that Ronnie Lott would do a much more damage than, than Deion Sanders by adding adding the power pass. That's why. Because he gets the enforcer. He gets the NFL 100, the, the what run stuff or reinforcement where he, he's able to be more effective at stopping the run. So there's a lot. And then he has that crazy hit power. So that's how i'm gonna go ahead and use it on that and that's why i'm using it on that card so let me let me let me know who you guys feel you're gonna use it with like i said i know it's there's so much cards to use it on but like i said if you have one only one card you want to use it on then use it if you have several use it on the card that's going to cost the most and then are are the one that's going to be most effective in your game right now and if they both cost the most like i said like i like i did i use it on the cards and be most effective in the game right now so that's what i did when i get my free nanify 100 i'm gonna go ahead and pick deon sanders that's off the top unless they, they release just a card after the fact that i really really want otherwise for now it's going to be deon sanders and i'm gonna i'm gonna get him um yeah so that's what i'm gonna do right here i'm gonna go ahead and leave it at that i just want to show you guys well who i'm gonna use on my 93 to 94 power pass on and then give you guys the ideas of how to use yours but like i said in the end if you don't have no one at the moment just be patient you don't want to end up powering up someone unless he's already powered up and waste training you know so 
Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and leave it right here. If you guys like what you've seen, drop a like. If you guys have any subs, subs to the channel. There will be more great and amazing content coming your way. Thank you guys all for tuning in. 